Hi everybody, this is Mark and Holly Jansen of Jansen Photo Expeditions. Today we want to talk about our upcoming Yosemite Dogwood Photography Workshop, April 28th through May 1st. Yosemite is one of our most favorite places to go. Uh, we've spent many years and many moons in Yosemite over the years. <laughs> and so we would like to share you a little bit of our Yosemite. And in the springtime, we love to go when the dogwoods are in bloom. Yeah, it's going to be a great time. It's coming up really quick. Uh, we have a few spots still available. Um, so why don't you tune in and see what we have to offer. I will start our little... Okay, just a few minutes here. While we're working on this, I'll let you know a little bit about what we have offered for later in the season. Uh, we have a trip to uh, Big Sur coming up in a couple of weeks. We have one spot available on that one. And also we have a uh, wildflower workshop we're doing this weekend. Uh, many of these are available on our website. Oh, and also um, Anacapa Island. We go out there quite frequently, and there's a great uh, western gull hatchery going on right now. So uh, we'll be going out there and exploring that. Okay, so here we go. Okay. So we're Jansen Photo Expeditions, for those of you who aren't used to, uh, haven't met us before. Uh, we do uh, fine art, landscape, nature, and wilderness photography workshops and worldwide expeditions. And we specialize in uh, digital SLR, Photoshop, Lightroom, group, and private workshops. Okay, here's uh, some dogwoods. Uh, like I say, they're blooming just about, uh, well, a couple of weeks. So we're all geared up to go for that trip. So we'll be spending three days in late ap April. And we'll be enjoying the. We craft you so so you can craft your landscape photography skills and experience Yosemite with the beautiful spring dogwood blooms. <clears throat> Here's a shot I took uh, last season. Uh, we had a great. Uh, that was a cloudy, uh, kind of cloudy day that weekend. Uh, we had some overcast, um, and there's a lot more flowers and dogwoods in Yosemite. There's a lot of uh, fruit trees out there that were planted uh, many years ago by the early settlers. Um, I worked this particular composition uh, with Yosemite Falls in the background. Really enjoyed this one. So there's lots of options for uh, creative spring compositions. Again, uh, another Yosemite Falls spring composition. It's a fruit tree also. Mm -hmm. Now this is a, a photograph I recently took there. We were up there a few weeks ago with another uh, winter workshop. Um, these are the, uh, the, the three brothers. There's actually two that are available visible here, but uh, this is one shot that I really like. Another thing you know, uh, we are licensed uh, to be uh, tour operators in Yosemite Valley, so uh, when you go with us, uh, we're fully licensed and insured and permitted to operate our workshops in Yosemite Valley. Um, there's, there's also lots of options to shoot water. Um, this is a, a small, small spring area that we photograph. In the yeah. dogwood forest. Yeah, doing some uh, long exposures, so we're getting that uh, nice misty water effect, and we'll teach you how to do all that on our workshops. We have many ways to teach photography according to your skill level. Uh, we work from you know beginners to professionals. So also we'll do lots with lots of macro photography. So there's lots of opportunities to uh, have some fun with the dogwoods. And uh, I, I like this shot just because it almost looks like uh, butterflies. But these are the dogwood oh, yeah. trees with the redwoods in the background. Nice. Did you shoot that with a telephoto lens? It looked like you did. You got some nice uh, separation. Yes, I did. Yeah. Um, also, we'll have lots of opportunity to shoot the dogwoods with the R Merced River in the background. So that's what this effect is. And also, if you get a little rain, you get some nice uh, effect on the blooms or the blossoms of the dogwood. And a nice mossy forest area as well. Uh, we also have a few other workshops coming up we wanted to tell you about. Uh, we're leaving for Big Sur uh, April 16th through 19th. We do still have one spot available yeah, for that one, workshop. One spot available. Uh, this is one of the most amazing places in California. Uh, in the spring it'll be green and beautiful. And uh, we spend some time on the coast and in the redwood forests along the Big Sur area. 
This is a typical bluff image or image you'll get on the Big Sur coast. There's uh, wildflowers will bloom intermittently along the coastline. So we're hoping we're going to have a nice bloom this season. Should be pretty good. Uh, also, July 24th and 25th, we have an exclusive hot air balloon festival photography workshop. Um, this is a, a great workshop. It's in Santa Paula, California, and we do get uh, special permission to go onto the property in other areas where the general public is not allowed. Yeah, we are the exclusive uh, tour operators for this event, so uh, we take you into some places that uh, you normally can't go if you kind of bring your own camera and just kind of mouse around. But uh, on this workshop, we'll, we do a whole uh, farm equipment, old barn section of the workshop. It's a lot of fun, followed by the balloon event. And also uh, the Channel Islands, uh, we go out there quite frequently, like I was mentioning earlier. Um, we'll be going out there on the 26th. Uh, we have a few spots left on that one. So if you're interested in that one, I would jump on that. Um, this would probably be the maximum distant time you'd want to go out there because there's uh, the, the western goals are hatching, and it's really uh, quite a magnificent photographic experience, along with the breathtaking cliffs and, of course, the dolphins and whale encounters we, we will have. Uh, Eastern Sierras, our multi-day workshop, uh, sets off on June 25th, and uh, so we go to lots of beautiful places along the Eastern Sierra, uh, the in the Alabama hills, the ghost towns, and up on the bristlecone forest we, it, are the highlights of this particular trip. We like to go this time of year where it's not so crowded and uh, it's beautiful and green. And we get you to some nice, uh, interesting locations. Uh, being that we're small group workshop, we don't take more than well, probably the maximum. This will be six on this workshop, so we can move around quite easily and get into some sometimes very uh, small locations that the normal larger groups have a hard time getting to. Then we also have a, ver a Ventura birding photography workshop on Sunday, May 3rd. Uh, a lot of people like to come to this workshop and uh, work on their sh wildlife skills. Um, there's uh, lots of birds to shoot and um, you know if you're planning on doing some big game hunting, big game <laughs> shooting. I guess. Uh, this is a good practice for that. And yeah. just in general, great it's, digital SLR it's, it's a nice estuary area. Um, and we'll go through all your settings, show you how to use uh, the longer lenses if you prefer. Um, and actually, what I specialize on this workshop is to uh, create a composition with your birding and try to avoid the um, obligatory bird on the stick shot that you've seen so much. <laughs> uh, just try to work a story into your photography. That's what we try here to do here. Oh, and of course, our Iceland trip coming up uh, August 10th. Uh, we've been talking about this quite a bit. Um, the time to book this is probably now. So if you're seeing a lot of our, our broadcasting going on in the last week or so, uh, we've been kind of really trying to stress the fact that if you're really interested in interested in exploring Iceland with us on one of our small, small group events, um, lock in your position now because uh, the time to do so is, is finite. So if you have any questions or if you're on the fence about it, um, you can contact us anytime. Send me an email personally if you'd like, uh, mark at markjansenphotography.com, and I'd be happy to help you out with any questions you might have. Uh, also on this YouTube channel, we recently did a, uh, um, a YouTube video just on this particular Iceland trip. So if you want more information about that, please uh, subscribe to our channel, and you'll see this Iceland workshop information, or as, John, as Mark said, just uh, give us a Give us a call or drop us an email. Or drop us an email. So join us for one of our upcoming workshops. You can see we have a lot to offer. Uh, we specialize in one to 14 day photo workshops of California, the American West, Iceland, Africa, and beyond. And also we do uh, private events. So if you're uh, a little shy about big groups, um, you can contract us out uh, to take you any, any of these places that we mentioned or, uh, or a personal experience with us. Uh, you can contract with us individually, and we can help you out with the workshops and also, you know, of course, Lightroom and Photoshop classes. Um, if you'd like more information, uh, you can register for our newsletter on the website on uh, jansenphotoexpeditions.com, or as we mentioned, subscribe to our YouTube channel. And uh, so we really appreciate you yeah. uh, joining us today. And uh, if we have any questions, if you have any questions that you'd like to find out about more of our workshops or if you'd like to do a private workshop, we are um, we're able and willing to help you out. Help you out anytime. So 
Thank you. Okay. Bye. Thank you. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.